Hey Heartstoppers, hey Slayers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're reacting to episode 1, Love, season 3 of Heartstopper. This is really exciting because this is the show that launched my reaction journey. Not so much my reaction channel because I ended up switching from my main channel, Billy Carney, which I'm doing a book to be author to vibe. I'm writing a book and reading books. I'm also going to mix in like aesthetic vlogs. My pillars are like lifestyle, booktube, orthotube. I thought it'd be really cool if I read, well I do audible dyslexic here so it kind of helps me, but I want to do the heart stopper and maybe like talk about the show versus the book and like stuff like that or the graphic comics or whatever it is, but I was really confused with where to start so if you guys could let me know or even if you have the time to even put the order to read read them in I would really appreciate it or at least just tell me the first book and I can probably get it from there but I know that Charlie and Nick are not even the main characters it stars Charlie's sister who I love so I'm so excited to like see her perspective and then I'm pretty sure she did a spin-off book of Charlie and Nick and that's kind of what projected the Heartstopper of it all but like I don't even know if the book is called Heartstopper like I know nothing but I'd love to add that on my TBR are to be read for like winter as I'm getting ready to film a cozy fall list of books I want to read. So yeah, I hope that's exciting to you guys. I have my main channel in the description. But yeah, this is the show that started it all for me. I'm excited. There was a lot of darkness in season two compared to one. So I wonder if three will have the balance of it. I always love seeing how like much older they look and stuff like that. Been a minute since season two came out over a year and I was kind of lucky because I started Heartstopper last summer so I had season one and then season two came out like a month later and now I had to wait like over a year for season three so yeah I'm really excited to see what we get into this season i did my reaction to the trailer if you want to check that out if you guys would like to check out my uncut reaction check out my patreon link will be below i also launched a youtube membership so you can get like the youtube episodes early for youtube membership the scooby tier which i'd love to do like a monthly or two times a month a live stream where we could talk about the show and kiki and stuff but that hasn't taken off so tbd but yeah if you'd like the youtube edit i appreciate you guys so much much. Now let's get into it. Charlie? Oh, Tori. If I'm looking down, I'm writing notes. I have something to tell you. I'm in love with you and I just wanted you to know. And you don't have to say it back yet. They don't say I love you yet. I really wanted to rewatch season one and two. I don't want you to feel pressured. So. Stop spying on me. I'm shocked you haven't said it already. Same. Like, what? It's not that easy. And it's probably too soon anyway. I don't no. want him to have to say the awkward I love you too because he feels obligated to. You don't think he feels the same? Truly obsessed with you. Oh, oh well, guys, also, today. I'm reacting to Agatha all along, and Joe Locke is amazing in it. 10 out of 10. Honestly, Agatha all along is probably my favorite show of 2024. And he's on holiday for three weeks, so. Thus far. So tell him today. Oh, no. No. Listen to your sister. Yes. Ah! What? Oh my god, the graphics, I like forgot. Never seen you in a vest before. I've never seen you in a cat before. <laughs> Should we go? Yeah. This is the best teen gay romance ever. Oh my god, so cute. Love. I'm gonna cook us a candle at dinner. With the what cooking skills? With the power of oh, Romance! Tao is so cute. <laughs> oh, I love them. And my mum almost walked in on us again, so you owe me. Oh god. Living with me is like a dream. Head stop! Stop me! <gasps> ah, the crew! Oh, is it summer? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, this is too wholesome. I'm gonna be sad later. Well, I did tell you not to bring all of that. I'm bringing the fun. Oh, my fave. Okay, working on his fitness. How have you not Charlie, said I, I love you? Yeah, sure. Of course. 
Oh, not those noises. I can't believe we're watching this right now. Is Nick gonna say it first? He's obviously thinking the same thing. Oh, imagining it. I love you. Oh. Never. Well, thank you. Um, no, not I thank you. <laughs> oh, Lord. She's so pretty. It's for my girlfriend. We've only been dating for like three weeks, but it's been a whirlwind. That's four pound ninety-eight, please. Da, 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 da. What is going? Ow. See, I got one too, so we're matching. Look, you for L. The sappiest thing you've ever okay. done. Open. Cute. A flower. <laughs> you got me flowers when you first asked me out. We're so ridiculous. I love it. <laughs> Same. I want the most romantic summer ever with you. Oh my god, kill me. You before you go to Lambert. Well, I support that idea. It's gonna be a great summer, guys. <laughs> uh, Booktube. They definitely watch Booktubers. You okay? You seem kind of stressed out. Open up. I want to tell Nick that I love him. I want to say the words I love you. How have you not already? Well, why don't you just sit here staring at him all day instead then? I forget that they're children. I don't really get the appeal. Asexual, right? Never seen someone really attractive and just felt like... I honestly think that's so sad. You think I'm immune? Do you think you're asexual then? Probably. I'm probably aromantic too? I don't really know what that is. That's alright, you can Google it later. You could tell the others, Isaac. They'd be supportive. No, I know they would be. I love you. Oh. I love you too. <laughs> this is so cute, I can't. Isaac, think boss! Isaac, think boss again! It's so funny because, like, they know they're making such a cute show. <laughs> it must be so fun. Hello. Hi. Are you hungry? Guys, we all deserve this type of love. Uh, I guess I must slow eat it today. You could always go somewhere and just ask. Do you guys want ice lollies or are you just going to keep flirting? Uh, you flirting. We're all full up, actually. Sorry. Come on your little walk, please. Such a nice day. Do you know how much I love this? This is such a vibe. Don't worry, the honeymoon period won't last forever. Imogen in the back. I'm having a summer of romance. Me. Nice. Alone. Oh my god, I hope she gets a little romance this season. <laughs> so. Tara Jones. How's life living with you girl? I love that they're best friends. It's good. She might be moving out soon though. She's been chatting to her gran a bit on the phone and she wants Darcy to live with her. It's healthy for their age. I don't want Darcy to move out or anything. It's just been a bit, you know, I feel bad. Oh shit. It's okay if it's a lot. You're young. I guess I've just been distracted by This is like Charlie, not him, right? Other things. Like he's looking it up for Charlie, see? There's something I need to talk to Charlie about. It's hard to know how to talk to him about it without making things worse. Can we go in the sea again? Please. <laughs> Guess so. <laughs> I love the music in this show. Mm, that was in the trailer. Come and see with me. I really don't want to take my shirt off. Okay, we'll keep it on. We're drying the sun. That works. No, 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 don't say me too. Yeah, I do too. Oh, shit. You Ferris, no. You're gonna kill you go them. First. Bye, no. No, no, you. no I, I can't say it first, now you said that. I knew okay. it. This is not the time for this. I think you have an eating disorder. Yeah, I know you don't want me to try and fix you or anything. I just care about you so much. Just trying I don't think I do. <laughs> I, I know that I've got some issues. I, I don't think they're that bad. You sure? Yeah, I'm fine. You don't need to worry about me. Are you angry at me? No. No. 
Is that what you wanted to talk about as well? Yeah. Clearly not. Um, the fact that he looks like he's crying. Okay, they're cool. Adorable. That looks like some bomb toast. Extra buttery. Oh, we moved on to texting and not DMing. Can't believe you're leaving me for three whole weeks. <laughs> it's gonna be the longest you spent apart since we first met. Interesting. I wonder how we're gonna navigate it, or it's mm, gonna be like a time jump. Maybe a little bit. A little bit. Very, very rude. <laughs> you know I'm gonna miss you a lot. I am gonna go and have a shower. Yes, I've got sand everywhere. Movie after? Only if it's not Marvel. Ah yes. Forgot you have no taste. Hey. <laughs> that is so funny because he's an Agatha all along. We love it. Taylor. I'm on a Taylor journey reaction too. Check out my reaction to Fearless and Poets Department. Next up is Red. Try living with your grand. Oh, don't take this wrong. You might have more space if you lived with her. I don't need more space. I live with my dream girlfriend. I love you. And I love being near you. But I think we need some personal space too. I need some personal space. But if you really don't want to, then then it's fine. Maybe you could just try it because... This is very interesting to navigate. We'll try it. I'll call her. Okay, I'm so happy she took that well. I love you too. I know this summer's been a lot. Thank you. For everything. Interesting. They're definitely the most, like, ahead relationship-wise. Especially for the fact... Oh. For that fact, and oh, yeah. they're already moving out. No, I can do it. I'm oh making dinner for my girlfriend. Just don't burn down my house, huh? <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. We can just order pizza. No, everything to be perfect this summer. Everything's gonna change when you go to Lambert. We've only got three weeks left together. I mean, I don't want to lose you. How? Uh oh. Nick? My mum said I have to go home. Give me two minutes, I can walk you home. No, it's fine, I just... You know when we were in the sea? Yeah. I lied. What do you mean? When you asked me whether the eating thing was what I wanted to talk to you about, I was actually going to say that I love you. Set it through the door. We want to see his reaction. It's not instant. <gasps> yeah, I, I can walk myself home. Bye. What? Wait, wait, wait! Oh! How did he not say that back? Idiot. Such an idiot. Maybe he feels like he wants to say it to him and they're gonna say it, oh my god, and then the episode's gonna end. And yeah, he's going away for three weeks and you were just gonna leave like that? He said it when I was in the shower. Sorry. No, no S1. Okay. All right, can you say what you said again, please? It's embarrassing. Oh my God. I love you. I'm actually a little teary. And you don't have to say it back. I just wanted to tell you because you're going away. I love you so much. You're not just saying that because I said it. Oh, Charlie. <laughs> I have chills everywhere. Come here, you idiot. You're still damp. You're the one who said I love you for the first time when I was in the shower. Oh, why did I do that? <laughs> why are we like this? Don't know. <laughs> because you're Charlie. Oh. And you love me. Mm. I love you. Thought thinking about a future all the time. Bop this song is. Black and white pitch. Give her some bass, girl. No, I'm kidding. Oh, sweet. Can I walk you home now? You're not even wearing a shirt. I thought you liked it. I saw you peeping at me on the beach. I was not peeping. It's okay, it's, it's allowed. We're in love. Oh my God. Laying on the car. Uh, damn, guys. Stop. Season three starting off so freaking strong. We love it. Okay, so I love that it started off in the summer. Three weeks. I wonder if we'll have like an episode in between at least of them being apart for the th three weeks or we'll jump ahead. There's a lot to explore with everyone's character. 
characters or relationships we could go more into isaac and imogen and like them because they don't really have a partner or maybe we'll continue the tara and darcy storyline i mean we're going to continue it all but i wonder what will be the next focus or those will stick with the b plots and it'll still be head on charlie and nick like maybe we'll be following nick and where he's at and what he goes through but i don't know very interesting this was a great premiere yeah so sweet i'm happy that we had a beginning middle and end it wasn't the whole i mean i didn't think this but i'm happy he said i love you in this episode and it wasn't like dragged out because it's definitely time i would say yeah it was so good to see them again the wholesome vibes are a one i'm so excited for this season if you guys are too please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new comment below let me know about those books please that would mean a lot yeah i will see you guys i think i'm gonna be posting i might double post this week and then post on thursdays but we'll see we'll see we'll see but yeah i will see you guys on the next one i hope it's billy bitch <laughs>